Earl a name. Um, yeah, you, you can name it anything you want. Chat, what we should call it? Okay, we're gonna call it Dungeon Campground. That's a great name. Okay. Uh, Is campground one word or two words, people? I personally would say that it's one word. Okay. All right. Then okay. Then survival. What default? What mode? Uh, the game mode, like um, survival, is that we're playing the game. Um, we can die, and there's like we don't have in infinite resources. But if you want to, you know, have fun and build big structures and, you know, just do anything, you can set it to creative. We can fly, we can, or we have access to, you know, infinite, like, blocks of any kind. Let's be creative. No end game. Yeah, in creative, we can build anything. And then it says achievements are only available in the world set to survival mode. And with cheetah. Yeah, um, you can just hit continue. continue. Okay. It's just basically you can't, you know, cheat achievements by going into creative. And then the difficulty, like, the difficulty slider, you know, um, peaceful, there's no hostile monsters that would attack you <laughs> at night. Yeah, that's too stressful. <laughs> yeah. Um, easy means that the monster rocks, monsters are easier to kill, you take less damage. Um, normal, well, I mean, that's the normal difficulty, and hard just makes everything a little bit harder. Um, there's not really any other... Uh, Let's go with easy, or peace, which one would you prefer, says Will? Easy, uh, or, or if peaceful? We're going in, if we're going in creative, there's no real, uh, there's no end game or there's no like real objective. It's just we can build anything we want, and there's we can't be harmed by anything in the game. So it doesn't really matter what difficulty it is. But if it's on peaceful, there's no skeletons, there's no zombies, there's no spiders. Let's go with easy. Let's 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 be a little a, a little bit dangerous. <laughs> uh, then when you scroll down, there's, you know, world preferences, you know, um, bonus chest would give you a chest that has like extra starting items in the beginning. I'm not entirely sure what starting map does, but, um, so what should, what should I do? Just leave the, leave them alone? Uh, just leave them, leave them off. Leave okay. Them off. We don't need them. The player permission when joining from invite. Uh, you want to leave that at member, so people can play the game normally if they join. If you don't, if you want to have people join so that they can only like look at the stuff that you have made, so they can't break blocks or place blocks, then you can make them visitors. But members say, you know, can you like stab them if they uh, if they mess up your stuff? If they mess with my blocks, I can. Uh, can I kill them? Survival. Can I decapitate if them with we, a... Yeah, yeah, if we go survival, we can stab people. But in creative, um, you can't, you know, you can't be attacked by anything. And you can't attack other players. Okay. But you can build stuff. Uh, then there's the world type. We don't need to change that. Then there's the seed. So if you have, like, a specific seed that you want, uh, if you know like a funny seed that is like in a small island in the middle of the ocean or it's like mountains, you can have a funny seed that you can put in. But let's just leave that blank. Okay. Uh, then there's the simulation distance. I think that's the render distance of the server. I'm not entirely sure. Because every, every, everybody in chat want me to go into survival mode. I mean, survival is like the definitive experience of Minecraft. So. I mean, it's entirely up to you. Okay. Words, okay. Let's I go. Let's change this. Let's go to survive because everybody's bitching about yeah. it already. Oh, <laughs> God. There. 
survival. You guys happy? Uh, then if you if we go below the simulation distance slider, there's two world options like friendly fire, which means that we can hit each other, or you can hit hit other people and they can hit you back. Then there's show coordinates, which actually would be useful. So you want to have that on. So you can find out where other people that you are playing with are when you have the coordinates on. Now, is there a setting where I can fire at the people, but then they can't fire back at me? Uh, I'm not entirely sure if you can like go, you know, creative mode in a multiplayer game just, just by typing in a command in Bedrock Edition. Okay. But it could be possible. I'm not entirely sure. Can we start now? Uh, I think that all the settings are fine. If you okay. don't want any like, if you don't want any like TNT explosions, then you can turn TNT off. But I don't think we're going to be blowing anything up. My, the only th the only thing is that um, if we messed up, can the game start from where we messed up instead of going all the way to the beginning and start all I mean, over from scratch? If we if we die. Um, if we don't die in like a pool of lava, um, we can get our stuff back and just continue. Okay, that's good. Um, but if we like die in a pool of lava or in a sea of fire, then we might lose some of our stuff and things. But it doesn't like if you die, if you're not playing hardcore, then you know, um, you can just respawn. So click on multiplayer now. Okay. And you can turn. Uh, it's a multiplayer game right now. And you can make it invite only or friends only or friends of friends. Okay, let's do invite only. Which one you want me to do? Which one's easy? Uh, I mean, if you don't have any other friends on the service, then you can just do it friends only. Okay. Is that it? Uh, yeah, now you just click create and it should start the game, start the server and I think I should be able to join you. What is this? Online play is not rated. Uh, it just, just basically tells you if somebody says the F word in chat or builds a giant dingling um, Microsoft is not to be held responsible. Oh, would people do that? That is just crass. Okay. Don't kill dolphins, you monster. Trade with there's villagers. Al there's always funny texts in the loading screens. I'm so excited. Hold on, let me gather some whole bunch of empty bottles in case I have to pee. <laughs> Where are you? Uh, I need to connect to the server. Okay. And <laughs> it might be a bit laggy since I'm on the other side. Okay, I'll wait. Where's my, uh, but... Now, what is the correct... Is, where's my Smantuska at? I'm trying to move... I'm trying to move the chat out. Hello? Smantuska? Hello? How do you pronounce your name? Uh, a little bit shy, I guess. Oh. Well, it's... Smantuska. Smantuska. Mm. Wow. Hi there. Smant. Okay, I hear it's a sh man. I hear I hear goats or something. What's that? Where's that coming from? Oh, this is that a goat down there? Uh, it seems that I need to have my VPN on to join the server, so I might be extra laggy. So, Smantuska, you need to turn your VPN on and <laughs> locate yourself, relocate yourself into. Americas. So I'm on your left right now in the game. 
I don't see you. Uh, on her, uh, just, you know, keep turning around. I th oh, is that you? Oh! Wait a minute, I look. <laughs> that's a nice, that's a nice, uh, what they call them? The shirt? Avatar? Oh, the Avatar, yeah. I, I think they, yeah, it's um, like, I think the more usual thing people call it is a skin in Minecraft. A skin? So, oh. The basic movements in this game are you move around by pressing W, A, S, and D. Oh, crap. Like can and you go? If you want. Can I use the arrow key? Uh. I think there might be an option in the settings, but. Minecraft overall, I would say, is easier to play with the WASD. See, the problem, the problem is I'm left-handed, so the mouse. Oh shit! Oh. The mouse, oh. you know, it's all on one side. Um, that's that's the only. Let me check the settings real quick. Uh, you can rebind buttons in the settings to what you want like um you can change what you use to jump you can change what you use to okay hold on sprint. what i'm just i'm just gonna make it easy right now i'll do it later but i'm just gonna move my keyboard all the way over okay so that way i can just use it okay so s w oh okay hey, where's that where's that go hey Okay. Let's punch it. I got you some meat. How do I pick it up? <laughs> uh, you pick things up automatically off the ground when you walk to them. Oh, um, okay, that's good. Hit e, if you hit E, you uh -huh. open up your inventory, and there's a recipe book. What is what is that red thing? What is that red thing coming out of my crotch? Can you see uh, it? That's raw mutton. Oh, that's that is that the meat? And yeah, that's the meat. It's raw mutton. So I'm holding I'm holding the meat in my hand. Okay, all right. Yes. So basically, the first thing you do in Minecraft is you go up to a tree and start punching it with your bare fists. Okay. And what's what so, key? What key is for punching? Uh, left mouse click. I don't punch. I don't see Samantuska. Uh, I think he's figuring out his VPN. Oh, okay. Because, I mean, I told him yesterday that it might be so that we need to get so, VPNs running. So what key, is, what, key, what key is to punch it? Uh, left mouse click is to punch. What is that? What so is that? What am I punching it with? What's that red thing? Uh, that's, the, that's the meat. I'm, be, I'm punching it with my meat. Yeah, you're punching it with your meat. <laughs> Am I doing anything right now? Am I uh, making? You need to uh, hold it down. Hold it down. Oh! Yeah, if you hold it down, it breaks it. So you want to break the wood. Oh, the wood. Um, yeah, the wood. And when you break the wood, you get logs. And if you go, you pick up the logs by walking up to them. And if you go into your inventory when you pick them up. Uh, you can craft with them. Okay. Now, what happened if so, I I smack you by accident? Uh, well, I take damage, but if you don't smack me too much, I don't die. Oh, okay. But if you smack me too much, then I will die. So See, what you want to do is um, you want to hit E to open your inventory. Yeah. And you want to take the um, oak logs that you have, and you want to put them into the small two by two square area in your inventory yes you press left click to pick them up and then you press left click to place Put, them down yeah oh so i just and made then, some uh, some some uh some planks yeah okay and if you shift click the planks in the crafting menu in the top right you will all automatically like get as many planks as you possibly can out of the crafting and now if you go into the crafting or place the planks into the crafting menu um, in a square 
So you take all the planks that you can make and by left clicking them. Uh huh. The ones that appear on the right side and you take all of them. Uh, just click it like a couple more times so you pick all of them up. Or shift click them so you can hold shift and left click and it'll like take everything. And where do I put it at? Yeah, uh, craft you can table? put it in your inventory. I, I'm confused. Uh, should I bring uh, it over so, to the craft table? Uh, no, it's craftable. It's not a craft table. It's a. Oh. Cra it's like it's like what you can craft. Okay. So you can click recipes from the left side, and it'll automatically place the blocks in an order that you can like make the item in. And you can also do it by just placing the four planks into the two by two area. If you want to place only one plank out of all the four, um, you hold all the four planks by first left clicking them, and then you have them in your like you know hand basically, and then you right click them, just you know tap right click and it'll place one plank down to where you right clicked in the crafting menu. Okay. Okay, I'm kind of it's uh, I'm kind of confused already so. <laughs> Yeah, it's okay. It took me a while when I first played Minecraft to figure out how things work. You can also, um, if it's to, like, if we just want to get the crafting table going, um, on the left side you see the, you know, kind of like a block with um, darker edges and a square on top of it, or uh -oh. in the craftable area. Like uh, the tabs on top? Uh, no, the one that the one that's like a block and it says the number or it has the number four on it. Yeah, yeah. So the Crap. number basically tells you how many of them you can make. So just click that. Uh huh. And then it like automatically in your crafting area in the top right, it should place the blocks in an order that would make the table. Uh huh. And now just take one of those tables and place it in the bottom most bar in your inventory. Okay, I don't know what that means. <laughs> uh, you have your inventory open right now. Like the whole entire thing is your inventory. Yes. And you just want to take the, you know, um, crafting table. Just left click on the crafting table that is in the top right right now. And just place it in your hot bar which is what it's called uh, which is the bottom most you know row of squares is it right it's right it's right next to my meat uh yeah just place it right next to your meat which one the the craft table items or the plank the oak wood plank construction uh the crafting table that you are crafting oh right okay now. okay play it there it doesn't want, okay, it doesn't want to go there. <laughs> How do I get rid of it? Dirt? Uh, yeah, just... No, no, night is coming, the monsters are coming. Okay, shit. Okay, what, what's happening? <laughs> uh, it's becoming night time. But that's not a necessarily bad thing. So, do you have your crafting table? Oh, you want, uh, you, you want to open it back up again? No, you don't need to open it back up again. You can um, change what you have in your hand by using the scroll wheel on your mouse or by oh. pressing numbers that correspond okay. to the position that they are in the hot bar that you see in the bottom. Yes. So, <sighs> just, if you, if you don't mind coming into this hole with me, if you don't mind coming into my hole. Okay, um, but I but just I just Sisu, I just met you today. Is that is that safe? Uh okay. yes. Okay. It, it is safe. Okay. So hold out the crafting table by selecting it in the hot bar, which is the row of squares in the bottom. Yep. So hold out the crafting table. <sighs> yes, okay. And now click on a block, um, 
like for example here when I, where I place this dirt. Yeah. Um, on that block, um, right click the crafting table. Oh, the inventory yeah. just popped up. Uh, if you right clicked the crafting table, you can see it's like a big three by three crafting area. Yeah. Yeah, so um, basically what you can do with a crafting table, you can craft a lot more things. As you can see, you have a lot more craftable things on the left side now. Yeah. What should yeah, I put there? So, uh, put, um, take the stack of blanks that you have in your inventory by left clicking them. Yes. And then by right clicking on the three by three area, place two planks on top of each other, like one and two, like not in the same spot, but like one spot and then the spot above. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, no, no, <laughs> we're making, <laughs> you can also, also, um, click on the, you see on the left side where it's craftable, there's like a stick, just a wooden stick on the left yes. side. Yes. Uh, so you can click on that as well. Yes. And then what? And it will show you the crafting recipe for the stick and you can just, you know, get a couple of sticks. Okay. And just take the that, stick. Um, just click on the four sticks, like just click on it one more, one time and it'll give you four sticks. Yeah. And then place those sticks in the one stick or two sticks in the middle of the square and then two sticks in the bottom middle of the three by three. So two sticks in the middle of the three by three but all... and two okay, sticks all... on the bottom. I'm confused. I got like 20 sticks now. Oh, did you make did you make all of all of your planks in the sticks? I don't know. I don't know what happened. I think you may have made all of your sticks in the planks. I mean, I mean, all of your planks in the sticks. Can I redo them? Um, I'm gonna give you some more planks. Please don't make any more sticks. <laughs> We're gonna get you a pickaxe. So. Um. Just put those sticks in your inventory now. Okay. And you see the um, pickaxe looking thing, which is basically the wooden stick, but now it has a curvy bit in the end. Yes. Uh, it should say pickaxe, of course, yes. when you hover over it. Yeah. So you want to make one of those. Okay. And once you make one of those, you can break stone. So once you have made one of those, put it in the bottommost row of squares again, which is yeah. called the hot barn. And then come out of the crafting menu by hitting E. Okay. Okay, how do I, how, how do I hit? Where are you? It's dark uh, in here. I'm in, I'm in the cave. I'm in the cave. I don't see I you. Oh, there you are. Okay, there you are. I'm, in, I'm behind here. So, okay. um, just um, you jump by hitting spacebar, by the way. So you can jump over that gap. Just hold W and jump to jump up here. Actually, if you feel like um, having more controls is confusing, um, we can enable automatic jumping when you walk to a thing where you can jump. Do you want to do that? Yeah, that's easier. Okay, so um, go to um, hit um, escape on your keyboard. And go to settings. Uh, Smantuska is having some trouble with the auto jump. Server. Okay, auto jump. Yeah, turn auto okay. jump on. Okay. Is that it? And now, yeah, just now if you now if you walk to like, oh, I got disconnected from the server.
I can't see a damn thing. It's pitch black in here. Oh, there yeah, you are. It, Is that you? Yeah, I'm, I'm rejoining. I'm rejoining. Okay. I got kicked out. Um, so now if you walk to, like, you know, this spot right here, like, if you walk against this, you should automatically jump up here. Yeah. Okay, yeah. yeah. Uh, but now you see this gray stuff. This is stone. And now that you have the wooden pickaxe, you can rake the stone by holding left click on this, you know. Stone. Yeah, but you're right in front of me. No, no, there's stone. There's stone where I'm not. Also. Okay. Just look a little bit down. So how do I, how do I how how do I beat it? Uh, you beat the stone by holding down left click on your mouse. It's the gray stuff. That's dirt. Oh. The gray stuff. Yeah. It will take a little bit longer to break. Yeah. You're a pro already. And now you just want to get a little bit of stone. Is um, this little bit lighter gray stuff, this is called diorite. Um, you can't really graft any, you know, tools out of it but you can you know do um you can make blocks that you can use like when building a house or something if you want to just get a few more blocks of you know stone uh you're breaking diorite turn around there's more stone behind you what about sun guides hmm? is there sun guides Sun guides. No, no uh, sun now you see on your right or right now, right behind you, if you turn around, you can see that like there's there's like those kind of brownish speckles in that, you know, yeah, stone yeah. block. And uh, that's called iron, iron ore. Uh, you want to jump up a little bit up here and you want to Is there room? on the crafting table. Yeah. So just um, click on the crafting table and uh, no, not your inventory. Right click on the table that you created earlier. It's up here. Ooh. Where's the table? I can bring it down there. Yeah, for can you? you? Oh, there's some daylight. It's daylight now. Thank God. Yeah, we can we can we can go outside. We can go outside and enjoy the sun. Just you know, jump up here. So um, here's the table. So you want to right click the table. And now that you have cobblestone, when you break stone, it turns into cobblestone. The table is behind you. Um, is that it? You have cobblestone. Yeah. So you right click the table to use it. And now that you have cobblestone, you should be able to make a cobblestone pickaxe or a stone pickaxe. And you can also make a sword, an axe, a shovel, and a hoe. Okay. How do I pick up? How do I turn off these um, notification on my <laughs> Xbox? Uh, hold on, let me check. Hey, I'm busy here, guys. Stop. Stop being distraction. Yeah, I'm. I'm getting a lot of invites and stuff yeah. as well. Um, I think. Hold on, let me check. Mm -hmm. Where do we just start building something like a house or something? 
Uh, we need to get a little bit more wood. We're just like, I'm just trying to teach you the very basics of crafting and all that. Uh, so hit Windows and G again. And in the very top in the middle, it should have like, you know, it's, there should be a, um, you know, a volume adjustment kind of thing and the Xbox social button. Uh huh. Oh, um, yeah. So Audio. There should be a there should be a cog for settings, like one of those cogs that signify yes. these yes. settings option. Yes. And there should be if you click that, there should be a notifications thing. Yes. And in there, you can select your preferences. You can uh, notify me when I'm um, invited to party or motivate. Should I un 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 switch that one? Yeah, you can switch that one off, and you can also switch um, sounds off of those invites and stuff. Okay. Okay, done. Okay, we're gonna take the crafting table and we're gonna go on an adventure. Or I'm I'm actually going to um, give you all of these. So I'm gonna show you something. So look at me. Uh, you see that green thing over there, just swimming in the river. Oh no, there's a skeleton here as well. We need to we need to beat the skeleton up. Oh, Spantuska's here. What the hell is that red? What is that? What are those? Uh, in the water. Yeah. Uh, there is salmon in the water. But there is also, I beat the skeleton up and the skeleton died. When the mobs take damage, they turn red. But basically zombies, they can only attack you by hitting you with their fists or whatever. And skeletons shoot arrows at you with their bows. And then you see that green thing over there. Um, don't don't come too close to it. I can show you what it does. It explodes. So you want to stay away from the green things. Okay. But is, uh, but is like any way like those... can can you shoot can you shoot at these thing that's coming at you? Uh, I... If we make a bow or a crossbow, we can. Wow. Oh. Uh, but let's go get some more wood, shall we? And also you can just beat up cows and stuff to, you know, get food. I got you some leather and some more meat. Um, so let's go this way. There's oak wood over here and some birch wood so we can make like a light colored wood house or a kind of like, you know, mm, well, I, I guess oak colored wood house. You can, this is sugar cane, this green stuff. You can make paper and sugar out of it. And you can use those items in crafting as well. What the hell is that? Uh, it's a cow. That I beat up. If you beat up sheep, you also get wool. You get black wool from black sheep, of course. And you can make um, beds, for example, out of wool. Um, when you're moving, um, if you hit control when moving forwards, uh, you will move faster. It will sprint. Oh, okay. You can also achieve that um, when you're starting to move. If you hit um, W two times, it'll also start sprinting. Uh chickens um when you kill chickens you get feathers and you know chicken meat of course actually that thing didn't give me 
a feather, but you can get feathers and, you know, raw chicken when you kill a chicken. And you make arrows out of feathers, so if you, you know, get loads of chickens, you can make loads of arrows and you can shoot the bad guys a lot. Actually, you have the stone pickaxe right now. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, I, I got so a wood I got a wooden pickaxe. Uh you have a stone pickaxe on your in your inventory. Yeah, as you well. okay. So if you come here. Um there's some iron right here too. We actually forgot one like block of iron at least. Um this is iron right here, this block. And you can only mine this with a stone pickaxe or a better pickaxe. So if you mine the iron Yeah, that stuff. So that's iron. And when you mine it, you get the iron or block. So you want to pick those up. Don't mine too deep now. We're gonna build a house. How are we gonna... So just get the... Just, just walk up to the iron blocks. Or all the blocks and you will pick them up. Okay. I can't uh, get that one. It's stuck. I'm no, just come back up. Just turn around and come back up. Um, let's go get some wood and we can build a house and then we can, you know, go mining with... Um, I, I don't really have an expression. What the hell just happened? Uh, what do you mean? I just hit the wrong key. <laughs> oh. Uh, so yeah, when you break down birch wood, you get birch wood, of course, you know, birch logs. And when you break down oak wood, you'll get oak logs. Um, I would recommend not using your pickaxe for breaking wood because it'll take durability out of it. Um, like your tools will break if you use them too much. Where are you at? Uh, I'm right next to you. I'm getting some wood as well. Uh, do you feel like you turn too fast when you yeah turn yeah out? yeah? Uh, yeah, we can change that too. I was looking. I was watching. I have your stream on the. Other I'm getting. Monitor. I'm getting a little. I'm getting a little dizzy right now. <laughs> uh, because it's it's it's. So can we um, go into the settings? Uh, yeah, so go into the settings, go to keyboard and mouse, and there is a sensitivity slider, and just slide that down to, you know, to be lower. I would say about 30, or somewhere like okay. 30, 20 might be good. Because right now it's too sensitive. Oh, it's too yeah. sensitive. Ah, it's too sensitive. Oh, that's much better. Hey, wh where's yeah, the light go? If you... Hmm? Why is it getting dark? Uh, it's becoming nighttime again. Where the hell is Smont... Smontuska? He's trying to figure out the he, VPN he, thing. He's having trouble. He just it. joined and then he disappeared. He, he joined and then he left. Yeah, it's um, it's weird how they have like region locked there or the game so that you can't play with players from other regions. So we you need to use a VPN. Now, where did you get where did you get all the wood to build that? Oh, is that a monster? Uh, yeah, it's a spider. Um, when it's night time, spiders will attack you. And when it's daytime, they will be, you know, passive. But if you punch them, they will attack you again. This will be a little hidey hole for now. That we can just, you know, have as a safe place. Um, you can open the door by right clicking it. And then okay. you close it by right clicking it again. Oh, did I just hit it? <laughs> and there is the crafting table inside. How much cobblestone do you have? 
I think you have plenty. Um, right click on the crafting table. And oh. there should be a furnace, which is like a stone block looking, yes. you know, block. And if you could craft one of those. Okay. Done. Okay, now just um, take it out in your hand and place it down somewhere in the house. But preferably not so that it would block the door. I don't, it's not showing up on my inventory. Uh, you need to place it in the bottom most row of squares in your inventory. Really? There's no room in there. Uh, it's all taken. You can, uh, you can just... um. If you take the item that you want to put into the hot bar, if your hot bar is full, um, just take the item and click on top of another item, and it'll pick up the other item that was in the bottommost row, and then you can, you know, place that elsewhere in your inventory. Well, maybe just move it up over here. Okay. Okay. Now what? Oh. <laughs> uh, you right click, place it down. I would recommend placing it down in this corner over here. How do I? Okay. Which I am. I'm behind you. Um, just place it like on the block that I'm. We just right click. I'm standing on. Just right. Right click on the green block that I'm standing on right now. I'm gonna move out of the way. Um, take a step backwards and then right click on that block in the corner nothing's happening uh on the very corner block in the left corner the green block right click on it i don't understand right click right click oh there you go um when you're placing blocks you can't be in the square that you're placing in oh uh okay now how can i um put a hole on this door like in the middle of this door can i make a little hole right there uh in the store yeah uh you can't change the doors oh you oh, can't I got, oh god i got disconnected <laughs> it's a bit laggy but um if you have any oak wood in your inventory uh -huh. which i think you might have you can make oak wood doors and oak wood doors they have a like hole which you can see through yeah but i don't have enough oak wood to make one of those which is why i made a birch wood okay we door. got we got to get um we got to get some oak well, what about like can you put a hole in the wall uh, yeah, but you can put a hole in the wall if you want to. You just hit the... You just break the block. But that's awfully big. In the wall. Uh, can we have like one just like... like uh, a quarter of that this, size? Um, no, not really. Okay. But if you put this... Um, put the sand in the furnace. Oh, I'm getting hit by a spider. Uh, I'm gonna give you some more sand. So put the sand in the furnace in the top and put some wood. Um, I can't put it down. It just, keep, it just keep on this window keep on popping up. Uh, no, you need to have the window on or up. In the in the furnace window, there's two um, spots for yeah. things to be placed. And put the sand in the top. I don't see the sand. Put, no, the sand is in your inventory. You have eight blocks of sand. Oh, okay. And just place that on the top. And then place some planks in the bottom, for example. We don't have any coal. Usually you want to use coal, but we don't have any of that, those. So, yeah, just place some planks.
and that'll make glass so you can have something covering this up this hole in the wall so nothing can like you know come through the hole oh how come the door change that's a different uh, i changed the door i made it i made a new door that i put in place of the old door So, I think I think we should just go mining now. What the hell is that? Uh, there's a. How do I get? How do I get out? I'm just gonna beat up this zombie real quick. How do I open the um, door? Uh, right clicking it. Oh right -clicking shit! It. The thing that you heard, um, the scary sound was an enderman okay there's water water in that hole let's not go in that hole let's, let's go in a, a different hole um so basically you want to make like a staircase like this if you come over here don't fall in the water hole um you want to make a staircase like this like you know always go one down and then you can come back up when you want to so you don't get stuck bottom of your staircase so you want to mine down on the stone I'll make a pickaxe for myself and I'll come mine with so basically just like this, you want to mine like a small little t staircase, and you can just follow my lead on the left side. So you want to mine one down, then you want to mine these blocks in front of you and make like a staircase oh yeah we should probably make you a shovel too uh, so yeah basically in minecraft you have like the three main tools which are the pickaxe the axe and the shovel and the axe works best for wood the shovel works best for dirt sand and gravel and the pickaxe works best for you know stone and other such things i think i just I'm wore out to... i just wore out my axe uh yeah if, but you still have your stone axe don't you Yes. Yeah, so just um, continue using that. I will bring you some more tools. Oh, Jesus, there is somebody having a drag race outside or something. Spider! <laughs> Did he bite you? I don't know, I beat the shit out of it. Oh, you beat the shit out of it? No, I, yeah, I, I whacked it with my, um... Oh, uh, no, I think, I think the server, oh, I got disconnected again. I can't get out. It's raining outside. Yeah, it started raining. Let me just reconnect and I will give you some more tools to use.
I will give you a pickaxe, an axe, and a shovel. And I will also give you a sword. What which is you can it? use to defend yourself. Oh, I got a spider eye. What's that? What's yeah, you, uh, you can use that to brew potions. Oh, okay. So you can make potions of fly strength and you become stronger, you can become invisible, you can um, get fire resistance. Uh, so I gave you a shovel and an axe. So if you come across any um, dirt or gravel or sand, you want to use your shovel. And if you want to break wood, you want to use your axe. Now, what happens? You keep on hitting, you keep on going deeper and deeper. Like, can you end up in China? Uh, no. Um, you can't really end up in China. There comes a level, and you can't go any lower than that. It's um, you hit bedrock at some point, and then you can't go any lower. I can't see down here. Uh, I will make some torches for us to use. So then we can see. Um, don't listen to chat, by the way. They're saying dig straight down. <laughs> um, that is not something you want to do. I will make some um, charcoal and I will make us some torches and then we can see underground. Uh, I gave you a shovel, you want to use your shovel for the sand. Is that so sand? It's in, it's in your inventory. Yeah, that's sand. It's in your inventory. You have a shovel. You can move it to the hot bar. And you want to use your shovel for um, dirt, sand, and gravel. Zach Field donated three dollars. Minecraft gotcha song. I love I love the, the 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 music for Minecraft. Yeah, it's pretty chill. Yeah, it is. Uh, do you still feel like you're getting dizzy? No. When? Okay. Why? Um, but uh, I also got a Discord DM about um Field of View or F O V for short. Um, you can adjust your FOV, which is basically, you can see a bit more to the sides, which is a bit more comfortable, possibly. Oh, okay. So, you can try by going to your settings and going to video. And if you scroll a little bit down, you can see FOV. It's a big slider. And yes. And if you want to make it higher, you can, I would say, about 90. Okay. Um, I, w I wouldn't recommend going above that. I mean, 110 just feels a little bit too much. 
so 90 could possibly feel a bit more comfortable to play with. What is that? As you can, as you can see, it's kind of, it's a bit different now. Yeah. What are these red flowers? Uh, I think they're poppies. You can break them and pick them up. Yeah, they're poppies. You can hold them in your hand and you can place them other places if you want. Can we make opioids out of them? Uh, unfortunately not. I think Montuska is not able to join because of his nat type. Um, so we, um, Smantuska, you being cuckold right now by sis will. Yeah. I'm going to give you some food that you can eat if you get hungry. Oh, what kind of wood are these? Mm, that's oak. Oh. Uh, if your hunger goes down, um, it's like those meat things in the, like, above your tools. You see those, like, um, meats? Yeah. If those start going black or, you know, disappearing, um, then you need to eat. I have nothing. Well, I think, uh, they only go down in easy if you take damage, I think. But if you play normal or hard, you will, like, get hungrier oh, than okay. in easy mode. What the hell? What is it? I'm running out of, uh, my stone, my, what the hell? My pixack just disappeared. Mm. When you're chopping down trees, you should use your axe. I know, but it disappeared. No, it's, um, you can hit the number two on your keyboard. A, no a what? It should, number two on your keyboard. The axe is in your second. Oh, stage, there it is. So okay. Yeah. Yeah. If you use your tools too much, like I said earlier, they will break. There's like a small green bar below your pickaxe and now under your axe. Yeah. That's the durability of your tools. So when it start going and away, what what the hell is that? Is that a dog? Uh, that, yeah, that's a wolf. That's a wolf cub. Should we kill it? Uh, I think I have bones. We can try to tame it. So um, take those bones that I just gave you and put them in your hand and be very careful not to left click. Do not left click the wolf because it'll eat you. How do I give so, the how do I give the bone to the uh, right, right click right click and it'll give the bones to the wall There yeah. Oh there's no hearts I don't think it got tamed Every no. time you give it a bone there's a small chance that it'll become friendly and it'll become your dog Can I kill it with the sword? Bones. 
Yeah, you can kill it if you want to. <laughs> Chat doesn't like that. Oh, where's it gone? Where did it go? Uh, it jumped over the gap. It's right. Corner it. Fractable baby. It's in a box now. It's 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 in a box. It cannot ex escape. Can we make ourselves a gun? Gun. Yeah. Uh, I mean <laughs> that would be possible with mods, but not in vanilla mine. So we can't shoot it. No, but we can get a bow and some arrows, and we can shoot it with a bow and arrow, but we can't shoot it with a gun. Oh. So we can't do the old yellow thing and take it out of the back. Okay, so... Um... <laughs> Another thing we can do is like... Um... You have to go and tell your friends to follow me right now. I need to have at least 80,000 followers or I'm going to kill this puppy. <laughs> <laughs> I can get you some more bones. Or actually, I'm already getting you some more bones so you can try to tame it. Well, we so have to but happen. we have to make we have to make the bow and arrow just in case I don't I don't get 80,000 followers um, in 5 minutes. We have to shoot um, it with I a bow and arrow. Some more bones for you. So if you want to uh, we can actually make these sides a bit higher so it doesn't escape. But if you want to come up here where I, oh no. What happened? What's here? The I'm mother? I'm in the box with the wolf. <laughs> uh, so you can come up here. Just come up here where I am. Next to the box. and I just killed I a chicken. Just to show... You have some... I just killed a chicken just to show people that I'm not messing around. <laughs> I meant business. Uh, don't fall in the hole. Um, one thing, if you hold down shift on your keyboard, um, you crouch down. And where you crouch down, you cannot fall off of the edge of a block, so you can't fall in this hole. But as soon as you stop holding shift down, you can fall down. Oh, okay. But I gave you some more bones um, if you want to try and tame the wolf cub. I don't see the bones. Uh, they're in your inventory, I think, again. Oh, okay. So you need to put them in the hot bar. I'm gonna hang on this, y'all. Yeah, you're doing good. Now you just right click the wolf again. Oh. What the hell? What is that? Uh, that's an enderman. They get hurt when they hit water. And I think the wolf loves you now. Uh, does I think I think there was hearts coming out of the wolf. I think it's your dog now. It's your little dog puppy. So, if you right-click the wolf with an empty hand, it will sit down or stand up. So right now it's sitting down. So if you right-click it, it'll stand up. Yeah, standing so up. So now it's standing up, and now if you walk around, it'll follow you. Or, or at least it should. Oh, there it comes. He's following you. Oh, great. Now you have a little dog pet. Do you have to feed it and everything too? Uh, if it gets hurt, you need to feed it. But um, one thing is that you see the tail is pointing a little bit upwards. The tail is an indicator of the dog's health. So if the tail is pointing downwards, it is hurt and you need to feed it. But if the tail is pointing upwards like how can, it is now, how can you see? I can't. Healthy. I can't see it. Uh, okay. Just move to the side of it. I mean, it's healthy right now. Oh yeah. Okay. It's kind of like pointing up the tail, so it's healthy right now. You don't need to feed it. But if the tail ever points down, you need to feed it because then the dog is hurt. 
and it gets more health from being fed. What the hell happened? Uh, you placed down a crafting table. <laughs> can we? Can I put it back in? Uh, you can break it by holding left click on it, and then you can pick it up. There you go. Okay. We're going to expand this little little box of how come, cows. How come I have two bones here, and I'm trying to give him the bones, but it doesn't come off? Uh, he, once you tame a wolf, it doesn't take bones oh. as food takes meat so you can feed it raw meat or cook meat cooked meat okay i'm, I'm saying you can even feed fish to your dog i'm saving them isn't... i'm saving the meat in case until he gets he gets hungry oh what's that sound uh there's a there's an enderman teleporting around there are these um I'm scared to say this, but there are these tall. Uh, <clears throat> um, let me let me think about how I phrase this. They are very tall. They have purple eyes. And well, yeah. <clears throat> I can hear them. Should we get oh. to? Oh, what? What? <laughs> I'm getting hit by one. <laughs> what the hell is it? What? It's quite loud, isn't it? Let's go inside! <laughs> uh, yeah, go inside the house. <laughs> I would recommend going inside the house. It's quite upset with me. Um, they where's don't my, like it. Where, where's my dog? Run. Uh, your dog is probably right outside the house. I'm trying to, I'm gonna try to kill this guy. Okay, he, he calmed down. I don't even see um, him. Uh, come outside. Uh, he's right behind you. Don't look him in the eyes. If you look him in the eyes, he will get angry at you. But that's an Enderman. It's a it's a <clears throat> tall, tall, purple-eyed. Well, can I kill thing. it with my sword? I mean, yeah, you can, but they deal quite a bit of damage, so you need to be careful. I just ate an apple. I don't see. Where's the dog at? Uh, I think it is next to the um, small puddle over here. Yeah, he's right here. He's grown up now. He's big. He's a big dog now. Well, can we train him to kill things? Uh, yeah. If you attack something, um, the dog will attack that same thing. So it's already like if you if you hit a skeleton or zombie or anything like uh, the dog will attack with you. Oh yeah, I was supposed to give you these torches. Um, if things get too dark, um, yeah. just slap these down. Okay. You hold those out and you right click them and it places them on the block you're looking at. I don't see the torch. Uh, oh, here it is. Got it. Yeah. So you might want to place some of them inside the house, like a couple of torches inside the house, because if it's dark in the house, uh, some skeletons and zombies might spawn inside the house, which really is a good thing. I don't know how to place place it down. Right click? Uh, right, right click on the... Um, for example, the wall or the floor. When I right click, 
the 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 menu popped up. Uh, don't right click on the crafting table, just on the like blanks on the wall. Oh. For oh, okay. There. And now, now if it, if it becomes night time or when it becomes night time. Okay, so get in. How do you tell? Get, hey, puppy. <laughs> get inside. How are you, the puppy just blocking the doorway? Uh, you can, if you walk into the puppy, it'll like push it. Like, or I don't know actually if it does in bedrock, but. Oh, I got disconnected. <laughs> it's a bit laggy. Because I'm on the other side of the world, but. So then how can I, um, uh, just, you know, walk right on the dog. Like that, you can push it by, you know, walking into it just slightly. You can push it around. Now it's outside. Now this door, is there any way I could put up, make a hole right here at the bottom of the door? Uh, or you mean like a doggy door? No, like, um, see my arrow? Like just a little tiny hole right here. How can we, oh, how, like how can we not have any like uh, glass on the door? Uh, can we cover there up? Is, there is one door that is like a screen door that has like, it is see-through almost throughout the entire door. We don't, we don't want to see through, we want to cover it completely. And we just have like one little hole so we can look through it. Oh, like a peephole. Uh, like, like a peephole for a very short person. I don't, I don't know if there is any door that would work like that mm. yeah I, I don't think there is a door that would have a peephole in it for a short person yeah I don't I don't think there is a door like that there is I thought we can make door. everything okay chat I mean, chat let's not get let's not get chat let's not get crass this is a very wholesome adventure right now, and you're turning it to something that's not. Um, chat, my, my, my chat is just being so obnoxious right now. Yeah, I can, I can see what they're saying. But yeah, so um, let's just mine down a little bit further. Now, and... what I'm known is, is like this is like a lot of um, work going on what about like um like some r and r like you know like going to town and have a beer and and looking at the ladies mm. go to is there a village where the the ladies hang out and just have a beer and just relax i mean i don't there's not really ladies but there's these guys that have very big noses. There's I mean, no, I, I, there's I no lady. Might be, I, I, there's I no ladies, but might be female, but there's no really indicators that would tell if they are female or male. Just to so have, they, just to have like a like a little relaxation. Yeah. How can you but, see down there, Siswell? It's uh, just complete blackness. I can't see anything. I am like I'm like just beating in the dark. I mean, I think you can turn your brightness up a little bit still um, in the video settings as well. 
if that's not it, at the highest value possible. It's like I'm just it's just darkness. I don't know what I'm beating on. What about torch? Yeah, so I'm go to go to settings. So hit oh, escape, setting. go to settings, and go to video, and check if the brightness is at the it's, if it's at hundred. Oh, it's right now. It's on fifty. Yeah, you can turn it up to a hundred. Okay. Yeah, and it'll be a bit brighter. I, I think it's I think still I, it's still pitch black. Uh, but you have the torches. You can use the torches to create light. So right click the torches somewhere. Oh! Yeah, yeah they give light. Um. That's much better. that dog barking about is that a hey what do you the want just barks pretty much always it is makes it... those small barks is that like a warning no sign reason. uh no it'll i think it'll like um make like a low pitch well can we since there's no ladies can can we build ourselves some ladies I mean, we can build a statue of a lady. But um, you can't build a real... You can't I mean, have... We can build a snowman. So you just, you're just mining. There's no time to like just go to the village and have a drink with the, with the girls or, you know, do a little dancing with the ladies. Uh, well, no. There are villages in the game, but there are like, there's no indication if characters are female or male, and there's no like bars. Yeah, but they have mo they have they have monster walking around. Okay, so maybe uh, I'm gonna suggest to Minecraft because they have monster and they have goats and they have sheep, they have chickens, they have dogs hanging around. What do we, you know, so yeah. you would think that there would be like, you know, like a, yeah. a companion. Uh, if you, if you come down here, there's some coal that you can mine this stuff. You can place a torch down here so you can see better. So this, um, black stuff, like the black, sp right black speckles yeah. on the stone that indicates that it's coal so if you mine that um that is coal ore and if you mine it you will get coal and this stuff above you can see it falls down yeah that's gravel so if you meet this stuff underground you want to use your shovel to mine it something green it's faster the shovel something green just um uh, that is experience. When you do things like mine ores or kill monsters or farm, um, you will get experience, and it is those small green balls. Oh shit! I just <laughs> <laughs> it's too cold. The torch. Oh, broke the torch. Uh, now we're just like two guys beating in the dark. Yeah. Uh, hold on, let me try and get a. Yeah. And 
basically you just look for you know iron gold and diamond when you go mining diamond is this like um bright blue or turquoise or and actually we just came upon a mine shaft down here where's the shaft uh the shaft is down down here okay oh, wow yeah that is one long shaft yeah there's a lot of spider webs in the shaft so this shaft looks like it has been used in a while yeah so um there's iron right here so this is iron like you remember from before how can you like, see like that words, okay so yeah how can, you, how can you even so, tell you knew it was iron in pitch black that's amazing so you uh basically you want to get iron lots of it and then you can put this stuff in the furnace to create iron ingots and you can use the iron ingots to create more tools and armor and you know get protection against all the monsters do you want to go explore Ooh, the dog just fell the there? dog just fell into the hole hey oh the dog fell in the hole <laughs> oh no the dog's in the hole now A dumbass dog. Uh, do you want to go exploring the mine shaft? It can be a little bit more dangerous than just mining, because there's like um, cave spiders that can poison you, and the poison will hurt pretty bad. Okay, what are you beating on? Nothing's happening. Uh, it takes a while because it's, um, I don't have a sword or, um, shears, you can break that stuff with shears or a sword faster. It was a spider web that I broke. Uh, so basically these mine shafts can have some good loot in them and you're stuck in a spider web. Okay, you're, now you're free. Let me create some torches or craft some torches too so we can see better in here. Um, basically in mine shafts it's like easier to find, you know, resources on the walls like iron, coal, and sometimes even diamond. And sometimes there's like um, chests that might have stuff in them and they might have like rare stuff like enchantments that will make your tools and your armor much stronger than it already is what are you doing you're just standing there uh i crafted some torches oh so that light the way so we can see where we are going. Oh no, there's a skeleton in here. <gasps> Ooh! I just got shot in the face. Let me, just, let me just block that water so I can go and beat this guy up. So yeah, you, you can run into quite a bit of enemies in these mine shafts. And if you look left here, um, that stuff over there, that's lava. And, and that's bad. You do not want to. That's that's the bad stuff. You, it'll burn you. But is it gonna is it gonna so, cover our path? Uh, no. But it'll flow, but it won't flow further than it's flowing right now. So it won't come any closer. But it'll burn anything. Like if I throw this block in there. The block will burn so yeah. don't drop any any of your stuff into the lava and don't like 
you know, don't jump in the lava yourself because you'll burn. Why? Okay, how do you get yourself off? Not how you? Uh, okay. You either yeah. jump in water or you just gotta wait. So if if you light yourself on fire, you just gotta wait or jump in water. I don't think there's anything here. It's gonna block lava off and it disappears slowly. And then we can go through here. How do you block it off? Uh, basically, there's like um, when you when there's like lava flowing like that underwater, there is a source block for that lava, like a block of lava where all of that lava comes from. Oh, okay. So when you break that block of lava by placing a block on top of it, all the lava will slowly disappear. Now, um, down here, there is a chest in a mine cart, which is, which could have like cool loot inside. So you can loot that if you want. You just right click it. and it'll open the chest. Ooh, a golden apple. Uh, the golden apple, um, it basically will kill you super fast and it'll give you like um, extra buffs, like you will take less damage. Yeah, but, my, but my, my inventory is full. I don't have any more room for that. Oh. Uh, you can you can drop me some of the like dirt and cobblestone. And How do I drop it to you? you? Uh, you can drop an entire stack by holding Control and pressing Q when holding over or hovering your mouse over the item. Control and Q. Control and Q, and it'll drop all everything that is in that stack. Or you can click it with left click and then click the thing outside of your inventory and it will drop it as well. So let's go back up to the surface after you get what you want out of the chest. Also one thing you can do, um, when there is something in a chest that you want to like, if it's spread out, like all the torches aren't there. Yeah. You can double click it and it'll like get all the torches that are in that like inventory view. Oh, okay. And they will all stack onto your mouse. You can drop the oak wood fence and the oak sapling if you want to get everything out of the chest with us. I think that's good. I, I can I can take the seeds if they don't fit in yeah. your inventory. Sis, why don't you take my seeds? Okay, good. Yeah. Then we can break this and we can take the chest and we can use it for our own storing of items. Oh, I actually took the mine cart, not the chest. Uh, there we go. So let's go back up and make a chest and store our stuff at our house. Okay, so hold on. Hold on a second. My, um, let me pause it for a second. Mm -hmm. Because my... Um, the video, hold on, transform. Uh, reset transform. Yeah, I don't know why, but my... Oh, it, is the it's, resolution of the yeah, it's stretched, stretched out. It's stretched out. It looks like it's stretched. Uh, can you? Um, you're using Streamlabs, right? Yeah. Or OBS, sorry. Streamlabs. Streamlabs. Is, Stream is, is, is it like Streamlabs OBS? Yes. 
Okay, so I think if you... Like, when you have the game capture thing, it has, like, the sides with, like, green. And if you grab a side and you hold shift or Sh something, I think, when dragging, I think it might be so that you can, like, squish it. Oh! Oh, my God! I learned something new today. You did it. You did it. Yeah, you can, you can shift. squish it down. Yeah, squish it down. Yeah, so now it doesn't look yeah, so so stretched so, so out. So you, you can stretch it out. You can squish it. Yeah, we did it. So, All right. Yeah. Okay, we got we got to go back to the game because someone someone was complaining. Okay, we zoom game. Okay. Um. So I think I know where we came from. So if you just follow me, I think we should be able to get back to the surface through the route that we came here through. Uh-oh. What's that? I don't like that sound. Oh, that's good. <laughs> uh, it plays scary cake Zach sounds Field donated sometimes. $3. Fan, you see the bar with your They're items. Spooky. You can place your sword in the first slot and your pickaxe in the second. So that way when you press the key and on your keyboard, which is under your Q key, from the server you will instantly pick up your sword or pickaxe no, in your hand. Oh, thank you, Zach. Uh, I'll do that next time when I get I get I get into the the the, uh, the program. That's a good idea. Thank you for the donut, Zach. Oh, what oh you... shit! What happened? Ah, uh, there was just a skeleton. There, uh, he actually dropped a bow. Um. How do you I pick can, it up? I can pick, okay, I, I can pick that up and I'll give it to you when we get. The, uh, so. Where how do we make down, how man? do we make an arrow? Because if the dog gets too big, we might have to shoot it. <laughs> uh, so I think we came up here. So just follow me. Oh shit! Oh, what? I'm lost. No, you're not. Oh, I'm just gonna follow the dog. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> hardcore parkour. Okay, I can't get on there. Okay, let me let me help you a bit. I'm just gonna make this a bit wider for you, so. Okay, got it. Hey dog, don't be a smart ass. Okay, and we came through here, okay. So let's go just, you know make a chest and put all our stuff in that chest so we can put more stuff in our inventories. What the fuck? Do you want to craft a chest? What do you mean by craft a chest? What's that mean? I mean, do you want do you want to you know craft a chest? <laughs> it's just a quest. I mean, do you want to do it or what's what do we what what's 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 craft a chest mean? I mean, it's just crafting a chest, in which we can store our stuff. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, sure, why not? Uh, hold on, so let me see. Uh, so you right click the oh, Okay, table. no, hold on, I gotta do whatever. Um... See, I can't move anything, any... Hold on, I gotta give you some shit because that way it's... Uh... Q, control Q. Okay, I gotta move some... Oh, why is it coming back? Uh, you're dropping it at your feet, and you will automatically pick it up the chest. Um, just right-click the crafting table. Okay, so he told me to put a pickaxe. I can't move it. <sighs> okay, never mind. It's too complicated. I'll, I'll do it later. Okay. What are we doing now? Where are you? 
Uh, did I get kicked offline? Yeah. No, I'm I'm on your left. Or. No, I you're not. I, okay, I'm. Uh, I think I'm gonna get kicked out of. I'm just gonna reconnect. Let me just reconnect, but. Um, yeah, right click the crafting table. And the way you craft a chest is you put um, wooden planks on the outside all around in the 3x3, three three, but nothing in the middle. I don't, have, also... I, don't ha I don't have wooden planks. Oak wooden planks? Yeah, oak, oak wood planks. Um, you have oak logs. Make those oak logs into oak wood. You have six oak logs. Make those into oak wood planks. No. Just take the planks out of the end. Okay. And now you can create, craft a chest. You can either do it by clicking on the um, recipe book, the left the left side. Crafting or... table. Uh no the um the chest oh chest. shit I just I just hit crafting table by mistake can uh, you... you can you can you, it doesn't craft it immediately it doesn't automatically craft it you can um click on the um chest chest items yeah chest okay and you want to create a chest. Yes. You can you can craft one or two or how many you ever you like. We're not, it's not like we're gonna run out of wood here. So then, uh, how, then how do we once we've done that? Well, you just drag it into the thing, inventory. Uh, yeah, just put it in your oh, hotbar okay. again and. How do we how do we oh. make arrow? Uh, I'm going to tell you that after. Well, I mean, do you have feathers? You have feathers, yeah? Yeah. Okay, so, um... I'm going to give you some flint. And I'm going to give you the bow. Just take stuff out of your inventory. Um, take the granite, for example, out of your inventory. Just drop it, um, drop the granite from your inventory on the ground and maybe... The where, where is granite? Oh. Uh, right there, okay. Red so it's control Q, side. right? Control Q. Uh, you can just hit Q as well, and it'll oh. drop only one. But if you hold control, it'll drop everything. Okay, good. Okay. Just so you free up some space in your inventory. So, I'm going to give you some flint, which is um, obtained from gravel. And now, um, you should have the arrow crafting recipe because you have the flint in your inventory so um the tabs on the left side the tabs um if you click on them the most left one that has like bricks is construction the second one is equipment like weapons and such the third one is items and the fourth one is nature so you can find it under equipment here so if you just go into the equipment tab which is the one with the oh sword, look at that so you can craft arrows. I did. I just made one. Four. I have okay. four. Um, the bow that I have from the skeleton, it's quite broken, but I dropped it for you. So if you take something out of your inventory, and you will pick the bow off the ground automatically. Oh, I, I picked the bow up on accident. Let me just drop it again. There you go. Uh, now put the chest in the hot bar, the bottom of row of squares, so you can put, get it in your hand. And once you've done that, just come out of the crafting menu. Okay. And. Mm, then you can um, place it right next to this chest right here that I've placed. 
Just right so click. Take the chest. Yeah, take the chest in your hand. And no, not on the chest. Don't right click on the chest. Right click either on the wooden block next to it or the grass block next to it. So um, you have a chest in your inventory. Hold that out in your hand. Oh, okay, okay. And you see the block that I'm standing on. Oh. Uh, I mean, yeah. <laughs> you, you just place it down like that. But if you have two chests, if you place them next to each other, it'll create a big chest. Okay. Which is pretty cool. And you can, in the furnace, um, let's create a couple more furnaces here. Um, let me just make a few more. So, now that we have coal, I'm, I'm using the leftmost furnace here, so you can actually right click it and see what I'm doing. So you can put the iron into the furnace and you can put some coal into the furnace as well and it will smell the iron into iron ingots. I don't have iron. And uh, you have 12 iron. Oh yeah. But you can see on this leftmost um, furnace here that has the fire going, you can already see inside, you can put the iron in there. Um, in there's already some iron smelting. How do I put it in there? Uh, right click the furnace that has the burning. Okay. And then just move the iron from your inventory into the top slot. In the top slot? Yeah, or in the, well, the slot in the top, above the coal, above the flames. And now the iron will slowly smelt into iron ingots. <laughs> Who, who just now you can also do who's this open who's items. opening and closing the door uh no i was checking what was in the chest because i thought i dropped something but i didn't now um it's kind of be like it's it's there's that kind of because you have to there's no windows the door is closed and the furnace mm -hmm. is going um is it kind of getting kind of warm in here yeah it probably will I mean, it, it's it's an open furnace. I mean, it's like an open fire down there. It's like there's gonna be smoke and so it's CO2. It's gonna be. Is it gonna be like a sauna in there? All right. Yeah. We're gonna. We're gonna. We we need to make a window, or we're we gonna die off carbon monoxide poisoning or something well i'm just because it's getting kind of warm i'm gonna start taking my clothes off what is that is that a window yeah that's a window that's a glass block um you can see through but nothing can get um, if you want to try using the bow, by the way, um, you have it in your inventory, so what you want to do is you want to put the bow in your um, hotbar and you want to hold it in your hand. I just gave you some more arrows. It is very low on durability, but, but, but does you should it, be able to get a couple of shots off. But does it automatically so, load the, the, the arrow itself? Yeah, it does. So the way okay. you use it is um, hold down right click. Uh huh. And when you hold down right click, it'll automatically load in an arrow and it will like draw the bow. And as soon as you let go of right click, it will shoot. All right, let me check and see how many, um, how many followers I have.
What is that sound? Uh, I took the... It was the experience sound. I took the um, iron out, so out of the furnace. Why is the dog backing away from me? He's... <laughs> He's, 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 he's scared. I'm trying to crouch down, but it's not. Uh... Okay, I'm going to go right between the eye. Right between the eye. Hey, don't turn away from me. Um, hold on, let me. Hold on. Escape. I want to see. I want to see what's what's the amount of followers I have here. Hey, would you be interested in trying out creative? So, because like I think I think because Smantuska Smantuska can't join because of his nat type. We're, we're cuckling um, right now. We're we're cuckling him right now. Um, yeah. Hold on. Um, 77,500 followers. At least 7,800. 78,000 or the dog's gonna get it. So you want to change it to uh, settings? To uh, creative? No, 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 no. no. Uh, I was thinking <gasps> if I would host just, you know... Oh, okay. But we could we could check what um, creative is like, since you have never tried it out and. Smunt but are we? Are, but are we? Are we stuff. able? Are we able to keep all the stuff that we just did? Uh, it saves automatically, the server that you have, or the game that you have, the world that you have. It saves saves automatically. Um, but but what? But, but yeah. even if you hosted it, it will. And. Um, I mean, you were hosting the server just now, and now I'm just um, creating another one, like another world in creative. So oh. we can try it out and oh, so to Oh, so it's going to gonna be... Join. So then we're going to have to build the house and all that over. Are we going to lose a dog? Uh, it's going to be a different world entirely. Oh, but, okay. I mean, the dog still is in the other world. Well, why don't why don't I sh why don't I just shoot it right between the eye before I go? Otherwise, it's gonna starve. If I leave it in this world and go to a different world, no one's gonna feed it, and it's gonna um um it, it's gonna starve anyway. So we should have put it out of its misery. Is it right click and shoot? Uh, you hold right click to draw the bow and you want to hold it a bit so it like charges completely yeah because this is like a this is like um what's it called a humane 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 way to to deal with the dog oh, where's he where's he running to did you just give him a piece of meat me yeah what is that? Uh, no. Did he just or, poo? Wait, I I may have dropped some chicken on the floor. Okay, so I guess he'll st he'll have some chicken. He's hiding behind the box. <laughs> He's hiding. He knows. He knows. Okay, so maybe okay. He'll have some chicken. Uh. Look at him. He's hiding behind the box. I can't... Sh he's hiding his eye because you know I'm going right between the eyes. And he's hiding his head uh, behind the chest. Uh, no, now I, can, now I can get to him. Um, but I think he's going to he's gonna be okay um, with, with some chicken. So he's not going to starve. Okay, you stay here. You stay... And uh, okay, so let's go. Okay, let's go to a different world. Sis, uh, what? Yeah. So what you do is you just leave the game. Like, don't close the entire game. Just leave your. Just save and quit. There. Uh, yeah. 
save and quit. If I save and quit, that means I'm gonna I'm gonna leave the game. Uh, it's gonna leave your like world, but it won't like close the game. And it'll save game, so the dock will be there. Okay. Okay, I'm just waiting. Uh, and now you go to friends, and you join my world. It's just a. It should say like my name, possibly Smantuska as well. And you you just click the server, joinable friends. It might be a bit laggy. I'm connecting right now. Yeah, it might be a bit laggy. Unable to connect. Ah, uh, yeah, that's kind of what I was afraid of because 